loser semis? Maybe? It is loser semis, dude. I got I got the reads going on today. <laughs> Alright, so normally like Dr. Mario does kind of poorly in this matchup, but the way Fonk plays Dr. Mario, the way he uh, exudes pressure is insane. It's oh, like absolutely. no other player I've ever seen in my life. Uh, have you seen a character called Little Mac? <laughs> have you seen his pressure? I played against on the ground. claws and oh my god. Yeah. Okay, you're right. I, you know, Dr. Mario gets a, a close second, but at least he has air game. All right, if, if, all right, if you want to talk about pressure, it goes like Little Mech, Shield, or uh, Smash Monado. Smash uh, Monado, yep. Shulk, Athlete. That's true. And there's one more character, Arson. What about Luigi? Luigi's Luigi? got stupid nah, pressure on Shield. You can, clap, you can platform camp him. That's not fair. Bad. Ooh, I like the breakdance move there. Giving him the DDR. Mario the DDR? <laughs> It, it, it's, it's, oh, he did a down smash. Yeah, smash. exactly. I wasn't looking. Oh, that, why, yep. I just slapped. I'm like, all right. Ooh, Ooh more, yep. Counter, counter kills. Tilt. Yeah, that's. I think he was just hoping he was going to try to do any attack, and uh, it worked out for him at the end. <laughs> you, you know what's crazy about that substitute? What? Dr. Mario was fighting a log the entire time. Dude, I mean, like, <laughs> you got to get all distractions off the field before you can play with, uh, you know, and to let True the mental abilities. The exactly. crazy thing, like this character, this might either might be like a dinosaur or a log that Dr. Mario is fighting right now. Right, but we don't know yet. But the excellent push in the game. Yeah, I mean that's that's a classic. I'm gonna punish your uh, poorly spaced aerial into a smash attack. That's uh, that's that's what you do in this game. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of whip punishing. Right. Uh, extend your combos as far as possible. So I'm not getting a. Uh, a down tilt and attack cancel back here. Yeah, right? he was extending his own combo in a way I haven't seen before, you know? Ooh! Ooh beautiful right, force, Right, man. that air dodge. Yeah. So, Fonz didn't really have any more options. He had to go for it. Either had to land with an attack or an air dodge. And mm -hmm. Starman just covers both options with one with one move. Right. Well, Fonz finding himself in a bit of a another uphill battle. Um, I mean, full stock... Full stock uh, behind. Starman is another character, or is another player I've noticed can be very, very patient in neutral as well. It's kind another log. It's another log. We don't get any cute <laughs> substitutes. That's, that's too bad. I'm a big fan of substitute doll, you know? Yo, Ooh. Ooh! Clean. Gave him the Timbs. I had no idea the Timberlands went right through the stage. It's funny because I forget that Dr. Mario has that down air. Right. He's got that yeet throw, too. I'm a big fan of that. Um... Ooh, go, goes for the Sour Spot forward air, or uh, Nair, which if you didn't know, Sour Spot of Dr. Mario's Nair is actually stronger than the Sweet Spot. Oh, is it really? Yeah. That's so weird. Oh, goes, he, he tried to go for a jab block, but didn't fast fall Ooh. just enough. This could be it. Oh, he aired on it. What? What is a win box? Oh, zipping right by, zipping right by Starman. Let's Yo, he was it. taking him for a ride on his water slide, and oh, oh. and that's how it finishes. Fawns. Punishes him for going a little too deep. He gave Starman him a not happy with that. He thought he had the tech. Didn't happen. Unbelievable. Game one. So like you might not saw in the player cam, but like he he didn't reel back. He reeled all the way forward. Like, yeah. He went to his knees when he did that yeah. up beat. He knows that I wouldn't say it wasn't deserved, but like it shouldn't have happened. Yeah, if that I, makes sense. You know, Starman didn't when you're trying to go and punish Dr. Mario. You have to realize that no matter what, you are putting yourself in a relatively dangerous situation. Right. You have to be very confident in your edge guarding abilities to, to also, pull something off. You also have to be really good at teching versus the characters. If he goes for tornado and aerial and upbeat, right? Dr. Mario's gonna utilize everything he can just to get back to the left. It happened so quickly and so unexpectedly though, I'm not I, I would not be ashamed to uh, miss also, that tech. I don't know why you went for that neutral air. Now I think about uh, it. Yeah, I don't know. He wanted to finish the game, I guess. Nice two frame and almost oh. got a huge conversion off of it. Yeah, Fawn's just carrying the mo just Fawn's just carrying the momentum right now. Absolutely. Keeping him at ledge, goes for an up e kill, but Starman smarter than that. Get reverting the switching the situation up, putting Dr. Mario right back at ledge. You know, I, I have noticed that I mean, does, does Starman get in his uh, own head sometimes when things aren't going his way? He does, but he's usually like quick about it. He's like, okay. alright, like that happened, now I just gotta get right back into it. But Bonds, like, taking that back air does 15%, by the way. 15% just for any back air. That's, yep. God, he, he is kind of the, the king of the, the low air zone, you know? Ever since they gave the buff, uh, every character has a frame 3 jump squad. He can now do double aerials off of a core hop. Oh, did that, did that help him yes. more than he it can, did other characters? Dr. Mario can now do two aerials instead of one. Wow. He to have like a frame 5 jump squad. That was, that was kind of a crazy thing they decided to do, and that was some great 
Yeah. Imagine uh, that was some great uh, platform chasing right there by. You're Starman about to say like back. imagination. I was about to say <laughs> magic carpet because that's kind of what it looked like, but I reserve that for uh, you know town and city platforms because they actually move. Oh okay. Yeah, if I that makes that. sense. Yeah. yeah that makes I kind of like like the imagination combo. Right. So if you do the down tilt, then you do uh, you know a little hand gesture. Yeah. <laughs> Imagination. The thing that's kind of crazy that we're not really like, uh, that we kind of glossed over is that every time they came on from that angel platform, they've been messing each other up. That's true. That's like the danger zone. That's like, hey, <laughs> those platforms have been kind of Fight Club City, you know? Ooh. All right. Ooh. She's going to try again. Trying to read some different DI. Wow. Just nared out of that, that up smash. That could have been pretty bad for uh, Fonz there. Ooh. <laughs> he just goes for a standing pill. All right, Fawn's in a kind of a bad position, but well, no. he he turned that around really quickly. <laughs> he just back through. Got, got. A I swear, Doctor Mario like has my favorite back throw in the game. Yeah, he literally like picks you up. That's the biggest yeet. The thing is, like, he's not like Diddy, where like he does it right away, right? He like holds you for a second mm -hmm. and then throws you. It's like with such force. He wants to make you realize that you're about to get, get thrown into the next dimension. Ooh, Go up air, really? Upper? That's not it, though. No. Yeah, Cal's having big blast zones. Going for the Timberland Stomp. Ooh, oh, that, that's it. That's a two framer. He was at the ledge. Yep. Went with that scoop and, and dupe combo there. Sweep with the legs.